you could we were having trouble trying to figure out how to how to find the railroad um i ended up googling it and it turns out you just come here if you're looking for it yourself it doesn't tell you at all uh you find this little manhole and then you follow the all the red bricks so we're heading there because well, let me get on the right quest as well uh we got a chip from a corsair yanked it out of his head fucking yoinked that shit and um we need to get it red so and apparently apparently the railroad is the place to get that done oh we lost we lost the path oh here it is trying to juke us out whatever is making that smell needs to seek medical attention immediately what I don't want to have happen here is I'm pretty sure that there's a huge like boss he's actually right there yeah big bad guy there really don't want to fight him right now <laughs> I'm not up for a challenge really it's not at the moment especially if we don't really get anything oh shit maybe we can just bypass this I see the ghoul in the fucking bus I see you well, there's a bunch of them. We were doing some fucking like flying shit. Oh! <laughs> I like shot him in the nuts and his leg fell off. I also fixed my aim. Or, yeah. I don't know what I was thinking I was gonna say I fixed other than my aim. But yeah, I did fix my aim so that I can... I'm still gonna use AP because I realize you can get... You can do some like more strate strategic stuff, but I just feel like I do way better when I'm just aiming myself. I feel like I'm a pretty good shot. But uh, you can also get crits and stuff, so I guess I'll keep doing that, but... I just, I hadn't set my aim up for this game because I didn't intend on uh, really just like free aiming a lot, but I feel like it, it feels pretty good. I know that they really worked on it for Fallout 4, whereas in the older Fallout games, I guess were kind of jinky as far as their shooting goes. I mean, if you're, oops, if you're f first person, it is a little weird if you don't have a, don't have a sight. But, not really a first person kind of person, if you know what I'm saying. Oh, well, we came all the way back to <laughs> Good Neighbor. So if you want to, if you want to, um, save some time, you can just come straight out of new Good Neighbor and go here. Little pro tip for ya. Doge. I killed this dog yesterday. So do corpses just stay in What? Hello? Do corpses just stay inevitably? Ooh. Got him. Hmm. I swear I went through this camp also. Yeah, it's still going. Uh oh. Whole bunch of super mutants. Whole lot of them. Ooh, hell yeah. I like this rifle. It's doing pretty good. Hey, yo. Oops. Yeah, let's, let's shake it up a bit. I didn't mean to do that. We didn't, we didn't need it anyways. And yeah, we're doing pretty good now. I don't say so myself. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why my... <laughs> I think either my E key is broken. Or maybe it's just a bug in the game. But I keep... God damn it. Oh! 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 I was wondering... Sorry. 
I'm not helping you, Piper. You're fine. Get up. Get up. Blue, we're not alone here. Back for more, huh? I have the high ground, sir. Still in one piece. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, I keep accidentally picking up people, and I don't know if that's a bug or not. And then I was gonna say, uh, those dudes that run with the bombs, I was unsure if you could shoot the bomb and blow it up, but you can't. Gotta be careful. It's not close to you. Probably pretty obvious, but, uh, eh. Oh, oh, that's a missile. That's a missile. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh. Ooh. Why? Why? Why do you have a rocket launcher? Why is this a thing? Who allowed this to happen? I need to know. You know what? We're gonna use blood packs, I think. So what did blood packs do? 50? And then... S40... I want to save my money a bit, because stem packs are hella expensive. I think there was some squirrel bits or something I had. Yeah, these ones are pretty good, too. 40. 40. They don't really heal you that much. They do waste stuff, though, so... Maybe we'll use this. Go ahead and chomp on that. Use the mash. We won't have the mash, though, I don't think. Uh, ooh, we got a bunch of squirrel bits. Yeah, we'll go with those. And we'll run! Get him, Piper! Don't let him blow you up. Fucking headshot, biatch. Yeah, and I decided last night, if you guys weren't here, um, I was trying to do... Who was here? Who's yelling? I was originally, originally trying to do a melee focused build. We haven't sunk any points into it, and I keep running into times when I just need to use my gun, and it I, the gun just feels so much better to me. So, uh, I'm just gonna stick to that. Don't judge me, okay? I know I'm going back on my word. I guess I never really promised or, like, put it in a title or anything. I just thought it would be fun. But it turns out it wasn't... It's not. It's not my bag. It's not my bag, really. I do, like, slapping people's limbs off, but it's just... Kind of janky in this game. The guns feel so much smoother. Just, like, way more effective, too. Because for whatever reason, this game is a bit challenging for me. So there's that. What? Who's there? What? I know Piper, flush him out. I'm trying to trying to hydrate. Shit. Fuck. I really shouldn't waste my crits when things are about to die. Shit. Hello? Where have you gone? Sir? Hiding? Fuck that arm up. Legendary Super Mutant. Oh shit, that's not good, right? Did he die with one headshot? I guess so. Ooh. I think it only does that when that's like a huge upgrade. I doubt I can wear it with what I'm wearing. But maybe it's enough of an up upgrade to change to it. It's not. Simply not. Piper, where's your hat gone? 
I know you can uh, you can dress your your companions too, but I, I don't know. I really like Piper's little outfit she's got. A little spunky reporter. A little spitfire. I, I definitely like her hat because it has like a little note in it that says press, but she seemed to have lost it. I don't know if it respawns. It must. I think so. We'll see. Maybe it's just gone forever if it gets blown off. The realism is too real. Okay. So, I think we have to go in here now. And then... Yes! Unlucky! Actually first this time. Let's go! Welcome in. Welcome back. Are you, did you scare someone else today? Oh my god, I fucking annihilated that... A ghoul. Nice. We're like a team, Piper. The fuck? Actually doing things. Okay, and I believe... In... <laughs> oh no. Getting the Sonic ads for Gib. I have my ads as as, as um, scarce as they can be. I would turn them off if I could, but I cannot do that. Sadly, it's not an option. But uh, yeah, Sonic is pretty good though. Have you ever had it? Not to make you miss it more, but uh, it's pretty fucking good. Hold on. I fucking want a burger so bad now that you said that. And like, you just ate. I mean, I just ate too. I actually switched to, um... Like a HelloFresh kind of thing. Except it's frozen. Yeah. Trying to watch the old figure, you know? Nothing crazy. Maybe just tone this dad bot up a bit feel like I'm getting I don't I just haven't been feeling that great to be honest just eating absolute garbage I feel pretty good I'm not hungry or anything but a, a burger would be fucking nice oh nice okay so we need to make this spell railroad from what I saw Ooh, yeah, working night shift. Fucking Denny's. Denny's are clutch as hell for that kind of thing. Like, every single time I would go out and drink with my, my friends uh, when I was in the military, we would always just like, we would re just respawn at a Denny's or an IHOP. Preferably Denny's, though. Or McDonald's. But still Denny's over everything. So good. Okay. So how does this work exactly? So that's not right. Huh. It spins. How is this supposed to spell railroad? I'm Confucian. I watched a video on how to do like get down here, but I just took it for granted that I would be able to figure this out. R now mm -hmm. Yeah, when you, when you have like relatives and stuff or like family that works at a place usually usually a go-to This is ominous. I feel like I'm going to get shot if I do this wrong or something. How am I supposed to do this? Oh, oh, I think I get it. So it starts with R. 
me and my character are in the same wavelength. Not really. I just realized that if you push the button, that's how you input it. So now we go A. Rail. And gotta go back to R. R oh. Maybe I need a space. Maybe you need the dot. We'll see. R. O A. Right. Road. I cannot fucking spell. I'm gonna be so embarrassed. This doesn't work. Here we go. Saving. Um, I'm probably gonna kill him. <laughs> I might do that. No, currently I'm trying. So my plan, my plan is to get all the factions or like. Just follow the main story until there's like a point of no return kind of quest. I have from what I've I did some research, asked on Reddit and that kind of thing, and like what the quests are that are points of no return, and none of them have come up come up yet. Um someone did say though, like when a blimp when the blimp shows up, but that was like super early on. So I don't think that that's I think they mean like if you go to uh what is it? What's their name? Fuck. I'm not a real Fallout fan. Okay. Um. God damn it. Brotherhood of Steel. If you go to the, if you go to the blimp and talk to them, then I think that that is a point of no return. But uh, yeah. I don't think so. Anyways, let me double check my quest. Yeah, I don't have molecular molecular level. Yet, or I don't have that on my list of things to look out for. So, if I'm fucking up, let me know. Stop Whoa. right there. You went through a lot of effort to arrange this meeting, but before we go any further, answer my questions. Who the hell are you? Wait, do I need them to con continue the main story, or can I just kill them and take whatever? They need to read the fucking chip I have. I think. Response would be appreciated. The Brotherhood of Steel. I don't know what that says. Oh, wait. So, do you. So, you'd kill all these people or kill the, the blimp? Response would be appreciated. I think. Usually, kill these people. So, I don't need them. If I if I don't need them to c continue the main story, then I think I'll kill them. <laughs> um, can I back out? Fuck. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna load and just. Unleash hell on them before they start talking to me. Because I'm an asshole. Stop Fuck, it makes you, it makes you. you went through. Who the hell Fine. You? To ask you the same, who the fuck are you? Why don't you tell me who you are first? You wanted to see us. So that means you're playing by our rules. So, answer my question. How about you put the guns down first, you crazy person? Put down your weapons first. Until I determine you're not a threat, we'll point our weapons wherever we damn well please. Who told you how to contact us? I'm not telling you shit. I'm not saying. We have very powerful enemies. If you want to deal with us, 
We require your cooperation. Last question. Why are you here? Red, red always leads to violence? Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Might have done that before. Um... What does this mean? I don't want to tell them what I'm doing. Let's say, hypothetically, I've come into possession of a Damn it. chip. Would you be able to help? You have what? This is not a joke. You what? I didn't know we were having a party. What gives with my invitation? Oh, I see you invited the Corsair killer. Nice. Deacon, you're late. How did I know I killed him? You're saying this intruder actually killed a Corsair? Single-handedly? <laughs> oh. That'd give even Gloria a run for her money. Newsflash, boss. This lady is kind of a big deal. If you're done interrogating her, you might want to show this coarser murdering machine a little courtesy. Just the thought. I owe you an apology. Anyone who kills a coarser is good in my book. I'm Desdemona, and I'm the leader of the railroad. Ah, uh, he's like uh, the fucking... What's that dude in Game of Thrones? He's got spies everywhere. That kind of that kind of dude, and he's a massive prick. I mean, I think that kind of comes with the territory. Yeah, v Varys. Yeah, fuck that guy. A response would be appreciated. Um, mm -mm. sarcasm always. Oh yeah, the little riddles and the decoder ring trick really make it hard to find you. Anyone that wants to meet us is under surveillance as soon as they follow the freedom trail. If you were a threat to our organization, all you'd find here is an empty room. Des, we need to let her in. She's got an intact... Well, you fucked up on that one because everyone's about to die. Our security protocols. To hell with that. She killed a Corsair. There's no way she's working for the Institute. We're letting you into our headquarters. You're the first outsider ever to be given this privilege. You're an idiot. We'll discuss the details <laughs> about your chip inside. You know nothing about me. And you will all die now, you fucking retards. Should probably really kill this guy first. Oh god, he's so strong. <laughs> fucking die, Deacon. Motherfucker. You gotta reload, eh? Is there anyone else? No? Okay. Fuck! You coward. Wait till all your friends are dead. I should expect nothing less. They were probably asleep. There's plenty more. Ooh. Spicy. Okay, okay, okay. Mm. Iguana bit. Oh, give me rads? Fuck. Thought it was cooked. Watermelon. Sure. I have like less than one rad so it doesn't show up. I really should just scroll down looking for rads. And anything that doesn't give give me rads, I'm just gonna use it. That's probably good. It's only just begun. And I'm still out of ammo. <laughs> Wait. Fuck yeah, Piper! <laughs> Dude, Piper's so fucking badass. I don't know if you saw the clip on my Twitter or if you were there. She like pistol whipped the Corsair and kicked him in the nuts. It was great. Fuck, man. That's so funny that she just like, she's like, this is mine now. I'm taking this. Glad you liked it. Mm, I think we can go with the shotgun. It's pretty close quarters in here, it seems. Just 
Come on out with your hands up and I'm gonna kill you anyways, you fucking cowards. Yeah, so it, it updated my quest to send me down here, so that I must just need to, like, find a computer and, like, decode this shit or something. You can't... What? Every time you modify a weapon, it gives it a funny name or something? That's, that's kind of funny. Yeah. I don't really like crafting, so I've just been avoiding it. Maybe that's a dumb idea, but... <laughs> Hello? Am I just blind? I can't see. The enemies... And try for a headshot. Fuck. Crit? Nah. Fuck. It's only a matter of time. Can't see. I've been cucumbered. Oh fuck. Um. Let me just... I don't need... I definitely don't need two of these. Oh, I don't want to equip it. This shotgun sucks. I hate how it only has two shots. This is a hunting rifle, but it's like sawn off. That's kind of neat. Fuck with that. Is it better than our other 308? What's a sniper rifle? Is this bold action? As long as it doesn't have a scope, I guess. Let me just see what it's all, all about. It doesn't have a scope. I like it. If it would fucking work, oh my god. Definitely didn't shoot him in the head. I'm just gonna walk around. You're fine, Piper. Stop being dramatic. Hello? Hello? I'm gonna trade to Piper when she gets up. Don't wanna waste anything. Old painless. As a predator reference. Oh. I you know, I don't think I've ever seen the old predator all the way through. I don't get the reference. That's cool though. That okay, yeah. Where's this? <laughs> where's this shotgun at? I would, I'd be interested in that. That sounds like a a fun time. Oh, he, one of the characters names his minigun that. Noise. Okay, let me scrub through my shit and what. Trade the stuff I don't want, and then we'll get back. Inventory management sucks in this game. I'm getting used to it, though. I have my little... Actually, I have my little sticky note to keep track of the types of guns I already have, so maybe this will be a bit faster. Yeah, we don't want that. Yeah. 308 we have, but I think I'm gonna change it. I don't like the scopes. Not a big fan. Um Oh, did I already No, that's a shotgun. Hunting rifle I wanted. Yeah. Oh. Instead of the sniper rifle. Oh, it's, a really, it's an extremely rare shotgun? That makes sense. And on extreme difficulty? Yeah. Not, not me. 
We're on like very easy. I'm pretty sure is what it's called. Ah, that's okay. I don't really like the shotguns that much anyways, but it would be cool to have one that you didn't, um, you didn't have to reload. Yeah, so I'm just trying to say, I don't know. Uh, shell. Yes. We got shell. 308. Got our melee. Or melee if you're nasty. Or melee if you're even nastier. Um. Forty-five. Yes. Don't need this board. Sell. Yeah. We need to favorite this one. We don't have that yet. <laughs> How to make cyanide. Interesting. Any irrelevant information? Hey, I'm kind of the same way. Like, I know a lot about, or a little bit a lot, a little bit about a lot of things. I just like watch a bunch of YouTube. Your other twelve, I never. I have a secret. I never remember passwords. I just store them on like Google. Maybe I shouldn't say that, but I mean Google's pretty secure, so I'm I'm okay with it. I think most people do that nowadays, like it's in your password section on Google. If I trust, if I trust anyone with the, my passwords, it's Google. I remember you saying that. Yeah, this is <laughs> this is your twelfth attempt. <laughs> you really should save your passwords on on Google. I don't. I don't know how to walk you through that, but. I would look into it. It's very nice. And then that way you can just like make a very, very strong password. It's just like a bunch of bullshit that no one would ever guess. It's pretty, it's pretty nice. And it's not like you can really lose that. Like even if you switch computers or something, you can just still log in. Uh, did I add 10 millimeter? I don't think I did. I did. All right, okay, we already had it, I guess. Her knuckles, we don't need this one. We already have a 38. No, we don't. I thought we did. We don't. See, this is why I need this shit. I need my little notepad. Yeah, yeah, we don't need that. Don't need that. Got a bunch of 38. Seems to be a popular round. Okay. Let me close out all these other ones. All right. You had this one going on two years? Good on ya. Nice. Yeah, I before I like consolidated all my passwords to Google, I had the same issue. Like never fucking actually, even worse, I had the same password for fucking everything. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. You know, I had that password since I was like 14 or something. It wasn't an easy thing to guess though. 
At least I don't think so. So I had that going for me. But I think it was actually... No, I had technically two, and they were both... They were both my passwords for, uh, like, RuneScape. <laughs> my first... It was like the first password I ever needed, I think, was RuneScape. I actually got back into RuneScape recently, because I... How I, I... I don't know, I keep finding myself, like, being tired and, like... During my game, normal game time, I'm just, like, too tired to play a game. And I just needed something to, like... Uh, like an auto attack kind of game and the new runescape's pretty pretty dope I, I really like it i know a lot of people probably prefer the old school one but i like the improvements on the uh, new one and it's free When I played the cyanide to the preacher's cult, I killed them. I killed them. Oh, okay. That was that cult was in reference to this cult. Okay. That's interesting. That's neat. I think I was good on payroll. We can hold on to all this other shit. All right, Piper, ready for all this shit? I don't think you are. No, just take all my... Break your back and carry all of my things. You useless woman. Oh, she's holding the minigun. Can I use that? take this thank you five mil it's got so many rounds we're using this we are definitely using this um yeah five millimeter just add this to the top hi mike let's go um, yeah, take that, and this, and that, and that, and this, and this, and that, and that, and that, and that. Oh, is that a star? Because it's a special item. I was like, what? Why would I have that marked? But I don't. I didn't. I didn't mark it. I promise. I would never do that. You can take the grenades too. I'm not gonna use them. I'm not gonna use them because I don't know how. To be honest, it's just kind of cumbersome. Fuck! I gave her the minigun again. Give me it back. Not allowed. You don't have enough main character energy for that. You try. I'll give you that. Shit. What was that? It unfavorited it. Shit, I don't know what that was. Oops. Hello? Oh, my grandma's sending me videos. Oh yeah, I <clears throat> it's like a rocket launcher, the the junk jet, right? You killed a man with a teddy bear? Nice. Yeah, drinking the Kool-Aid, that's where that uh term comes from. I I've heard I don't I didn't know what the exact cult was, but I've definitely heard that before. Right. Okay, she's full. She's a full girl. You're a real girl. I don't know why I couldn't say that in a high-pitched voice. It said like real gall for some reason. Okay. I love how you, <laughs> when you holster it, I really wanted, because 
I originally wanted to mod this game, but the game I decided to play before this fucking broke itself, and after I installed all the mods that I wanted, without knowing how to mod, which was dumb, but uh, it's the game was, wasn't working, so I just got rid of all the mods, but one of the mods I really wanted was uh, to be able to holster stuff. I wonder if this, w I wonder if the minigun would holster on your back. <laughs> that would be neat. Yeah, I do all kinds of silly voices. It's just fun. All right, um, what are we doing? Field test, uh, active bus. Insti de decoding Institute Tech. Did it not work? What happened? Okay, I was about to say, like, is there something else I need, need to do there? Decode the chip. Return to Virgil. Ah, shit. I kind of knew we'd... You know what? We could just... We could fat, fast travel there, can't we? Can we fast travel to Virgil? I sure fucking hope so. Because I don't want to trek all the way back out there. have to use my power harmares. So then I got to go find that shit. Why can't I get out of here? Oh, there we go. Ah, I see. Yeah, I, I like to sing too. Uh, I don't usually share it with people, but if I'm feeling feeling a little reckless, I'll send people stuff. Little little uh little ditties or whatever. I was in a band, but uh, that <laughs> it didn't go how I. I thought it would. I was like the only serious person in this band. It, I don't know. It rubbed me the wrong way. Cause we would, we like agreed. We agreed that we'd all meet for like band practice, like once a week or something, right? And I would like write stuff. I would write like a whole songs with like the music in mind uh, and I tell them like hey this is what I'm so I'm thinking and I'd like show them the lyrics and they would like a couple times they just straight up laughed at me and I was like all right well I don't see you guys fucking doing anything saying you played in bands do you, you play instruments too? Because all, all I all I've ever done is just sing. I can't um, not in instrumentally inclined. Hold on. So nice. We can fast travel. Yes. Yeah. Let's go. Lead singer and bassist. That's a that's a real popular combo. Run! Get inside! Shit, is it still gonna be radiation inside? I hope not. Good, good. I'm not a threat. I just have a giant machine. Fucking minigun. <laughs> See, like, at least, at least, I would, I would have been happy if, like, 
But like all these people knew like they were decent musicians, but like they didn't want to fucking do anything. It was really annoying. I digress. Wasn't sure I'd see you again. You managed to get what you need. Don't fucking question me, big booger man. I told you I'd get it done, didn't I? Forgive me for questioning whether you might survive against a courser. Still, suppose I should have expected it. You did get rid of Kellogg after all. Not too much of a leap to take down a courser. How'd you manage to get it decoded? Yeah, does it matter? I don't want to tell you. I mean, <laughs> fucking, there's blood all over my helmet. I didn't do anything, okay? You can't, prov matter? can't prove it. Oh, you're right. It doesn't really. The point is that you got it. You're not the only one who's been busy. I did the best I could. From memory and things I've overheard through the years, came up with some schematics for you. Wasn't easy. These hands are ridiculous. Fine motor skills have gone to shit. Here's the simple explanation. You need to build a device that will hijack the signal the Institute uses to teleport coursers and send you instead. You know the craziest part of the design? That classical music station, that's the carrier signal for the relay. All the data's on harmonic frequencies. You've been hearing it all along. I Actually, no, I haven't, because DMCA. This is <laughs> my area of expertise. I was bioscience, not engineering or advanced systems or anything. You get free beers for playing. That's kind of it's kind of neat. Hey, I'm talking to you. Oh, I, yeah, but the end of that. Yeah, that could be an issue. Well, I mean, it sounds like you like came out of that though, a bit. I hope. You gonna say something? Shut the fuck up. I'm reading. Yeah. So I think actually now would be the point. I'll check the quests, but they did also say like one, once you enter the Institute, then that's that is uh, a definite ending point. That you need. If you want to do the side quests and stuff, you should probably do that. Um, sarcasm. Your confidence is staggering. I'm just saying, I can't guarantee it'll work, but if you can build this device and make use of that code. You should be able to override the signal from the Institute's relay, can you? I mean, can you build it? You have people that can help. This is a lot for one person, even you. Yeah, but I mean, like... Who doesn't smoke a lot of pot, right? <laughs> I feel like it's super common. I currently, and I do not, I don't plan on it. Aside from, I don't know. Yeah, I, I, I don't. I would not mind trying like a really tiny amount of an edible, maybe, maybe, you know, get a little wild and crazy. But I've never tried any drugs. I've never smoked. I don't really drink that much. So that's me, but that's good though, yeah. Waffle houses are rough, man. <laughs> it's a rough place to be. Hey, I'm Feel that. To you. 
I know you're fucking talking to me, all right? I'm, I'm trying to talk. I'm having an other conversation, Virgil. You don't fucking care, apparently. Um, yeah, don't doubt me. Come on. Have I given you reason to doubt me? No. But do you realize how critical this is for both of us? And don't you forget our agreement. I've helped you as best I can if you make it in there. You find that serum. It's my only hope for ever being normal. I'm not gonna do that, Virgil. Find it. No, We're not friends. Take these and get to work. You do whatever it takes. Call on whoever you know to help you. Protect and serve. <laughs> Protect and serve. Alright, what is the quest I'm on now? It's the same one. Okay, um, so now now we're choosing our side, right? Something like that. I think I could still talk to the Minutemen and then Bunker Hill. Batter, the Battle of Bunker Hill is, is their um, no turning back point. Yeah, let me go talk to them. They're in Sanctuary, right? Right? Just because he's a big ass, fucking smart ass, green thing, he thinks he can fucking boss me around? Just. Interject himself into conversations? What an asshole. Yeah, your hair is burning, okay? Whatever. We're gonna fucking get beamed up in a second. Just calm down. Yeah, let me talk to the Minutemen. And then. I don't I really don't feel like we're that far into the game yet, so I'm I'm, I'm having a lot of fun So I, I think I'll definitely do some side quests. Maybe at least for this stream and I'll see Oh shit, is that the reload? What the fuck? Oh <laughs> My voice just like did not it did not work there. I was like ah. Hello, oh there's a marker yeah, so definitely for the rest of this stream, and then I'll see how I'm feeling on Wednesday. See if I want to continue doing side quests or not. Um, someone told me after the, around about this point, there's like 10 hours of the main story left. So I'll keep that in mind. That's not bad. That's just that's maybe three streams if I'm really slow. What do you need? That's not bad. That's a, that's just a week. I can do that. Even if I'm like completely burnt out on the game. I just don't like being burnt out and I get burnt out really easily. So that's what I try to avoid. Um, need your help? It's complicated. All you need to know is there's a machine that can get me inside the Institute. The Institute? Why in the world would you want to mess around with them? Right? You're just like lugging. I, I, I love stuff like that. I watch, um, what was it? What's it called? I haven't watched it in a while. I don't think they've made it in a while, but it's, uh, I don't think we were done. It's with Kyle Hill and he, he applies science to, um, like comic books and stuff so like one of my favorites is if the, if the hulk clapped in real life how in the movies and stuff it like sends a giant shockwave and like throws cars and shit if that actually happened in real life if there was anything flammable around him it would all catch on fire like that's fucking dope like why would that not be in <laughs> in the comic they just didn't know i guess but it's just like the physics of movies and stuff is cooler in real life than in the movie sometimes and it's really neat. You need a minute. Yeah, it's supposed to be 
mounted. Like, yeah, I need more guns, please. Take your time. Yeah, because science, that's what it's called. Oh, cool. What what's um what's his new channel? I, I'm literally gonna write it down and probably subscribe later tonight. That guy's dope. Like I love fun science stuff like that. Science was my favorite uh, subject in school. Just so neat. Fucking Bill Nye, dude. Bill Nye. What a fucking legend. Making stuff fun. The goat. Uh, what? Doesn't matter. I just need to know if you can help me. We'll give you whatever help we can. Don't worry about that. Now, assuming you could build this thing, what exactly does it do? <laughs> yeah, right. Like super speed would fucking vaporize everyone. Yeah, <laughs> or like lightsabers if if they were real and like not contained. Well, if they were real, we don't have the technology to contain the heat. So if you turned it on in a room, it would burn everyone. It would, again, light everything on fire around it. And then if you moved it close to someone, they would glow like very, very bright. And then they would fucking just like explode <laughs> because all the, all the moisture in their body would boil and they would fucking, it, yes, all of the things. <laughs> Just his name, Kyle? What about his name? Oh, you're saying, is that the name of his channel? That probably makes sense. Yeah, I mean... So. Kyle. What a cool dude. Um... Okay. Get me inside, now! It gets me inside, inside. the Institute. That's all that matters. Okay, General. If you think you Thank you. Work, I got it. Then you should see if Sturgis can make heads or tails of those plans. Our scouts have found a promising spot for a new settlement. The trouble is that some kind of vicious beasts are lairing there. Once you clear it out, yeah. set up a radio beacon to let settlers know about it. Before you know it, we'll have a thriving new farm instead of wasteland. We'll take back the Commonwealth, one piece at a time. The help you then you help me kind of situation i i'm seeing okay so i could have chose that was my choosing point there i guess but i definitely i know my first playthrough i i went with um i definitely went with the brotherhood just because i thought it was cool i like i like their their aesthetic I didn't really pay attention that much, to be honest. Oh, well, I guess so. It's like the dialogue and whatnot. So we, we, if we're, if this made me go with the Minutemen, that's fine. I don't really care. Just, uh, Preston oh, okay. thought you might be able to figure out these plans for me. Sure thing. I know I have. Let's see what you've got. my weight around here, and and I'm really trying to do better. Oh, I don't think I saw that one about Magneto. He can make a bomb and a lightsaber. I think, well, it's actually in the movies. Like he can just fly, but I think they, I think what he said is he could fly anywhere, but they make it seem like he needs railroads to fly or something. But I mean, the fucking magnetic fields of the earth, right? Like he pulls, he fucking pulls the iron out of some dude's body and makes them into like bullets the, like and he has to use railroads to fly what the fuck is this <laughs> um can you build this or not you better work fast eh? I need to know if you can build this wow what a mess 
Looks like, uh, encrypted <laughs> RF transmissions. Okay, so that gets routed through... What the hell? Teleportation? This is some pretty crazy shit. I know, right? Are you sure it's for real? I don't know. Might be. Might be fake. An army of iron shavings. You're not wrong. Why would he not just do that? Yeah, right? He could make... Probably take a lot of energy or whatever. I don't know. They don't explain, like, does he have a mana bar? You know? Does he ever get tired from using his powers? Is that a thing in, in the X-Men? But yeah, he could just, like, take a bunch of metal scraps and turn them into armies and shit. Uh, yeah, don't fucking question me. It was an order. I wouldn't be wasting your time if I didn't think it was real. Okay, okay. But you gotta admit, it isn't every day somebody asked me to build them a teleport hijack. Anyway, the eggheads never think about the nuts and bolts of actually making something work. But, uh, looks like it's all here. Yeah, I'm gonna need some time to study this thing. The handwriting's pretty hard to make out. But, uh, you can get started on what he calls a stabilized reflector platform. Uh, It'll need some pretty high-grade metals, but it's basically not that different than the lining of a jet engine or something like that. So I have to find a jet engine, is what we're saying. Yeah, you better get started on finding that jet engine, bucko. Just tell me what we need so I can get started. Yeah, sure. I gotta find it, don't I? list of what you'll need for the first piece. I'm pretty sure we've got all that at Sanctuary. If you want to build it there, while you're working on that, I'll get busy figuring out how to actually build the rest of this thing. Keep in mind, I can already see this is going to take a crazy amount of juice. Like if you had a spare nuclear reactor handy, we could probably use it. <laughs> and it's going to be big. Oh yeah, I got one of those back, at, building side with lots back of in, my, in my room. I'll just grab it. You know, just a nuclear reactor, it's not that big a deal. Fuck. So what do I got to do? Craft shit, build a reflector platform. I didn't want to do this. It's the same quest it is. Okay. I wanted to thank you for Look helping us out in Concord. Who are you fucking talking? If only we'd run into you sooner. Shut up. Um. Special. Oh, okay. It's probably just this thing, eh? E. Let's. Enter. What do I need? Steel. Oh, I gotta place it somewhere. I see. Let's put it in the driveway here. Is that is that okay? Anybody opposed to this? Did I do it. Hey Sturgis. How's it going? Did you find a good spot to build your signal interceptor? Yeah, I hope it's okay. I put it in the driveway. There's a giant metal pizza sitting on the ground now, so... <laughs> yeah. I was just asking. No need for the snide remarks. I think I got the rest of this control. Always need the snide out. remarks. Here's a list of three things that may be harder to find. I think I'll be able to pull together everything else we're going to need. I'll meet you over at the building site and see if we can actually make this thing work. Get started now. I'd better get started. Okay. One thing to keep in mind while you're building this, it all needs to be wired together so all the pieces can talk to each other. I'll see you over at the building site. Good luck. Okay, why is it just pointing to this? Oh, hold V. Yeah. Hope this rain lets up soon. And then what? Fire's power? No. I should have done more.
Okay, yeah, we gotta build all this shit. Um, no biometric scanner. Do I have that? Where would that be? Hmm. What's this just crafting? Okay. Well, I don't know how. It's, I'm gonna have to end up looking this stuff up, I think, probably. I am big dumb. I didn't see the scanner. I think I saw the emitter, beam emitter. Okay, we just need a military grade something. All right. Relay dish. Hmm, okay, we could just make this. Hey, yo. I had a feeling that I, I could probably just make some of this stuff right off the bat. I hope you find your son. Yeah, thanks. No one asked. No one asked you. In the console. Build the console. Biometric scanner, okay. So, okay, so we need to go to both sites. We need to go to the military and a hospital and raid through there and try to find some emitters. Will it show me where I need to go? I think so. Um, I'm thinking this is a, this is a spot. Right, we haven't discovered that yet. Uh, let's go here. We'll search through here like a mad, fucking mad person. I was gonna say I might want to sell first, but nah, it's fucking annoying, man. It's so goddamn annoying. Why did they make it this way? I will avoid it at all costs. No. I want my weapons so I'm ready to fucking fight. Yes, please. You might. Trusty rifle. This is it underground? The fuck? Right in this hill, huh? That's neat. Oh, that's a turret. Must be something important here. Hey, I think. I wonder if this is normal All for other it's right there. That's one way to keep out uninvited guests. I heard something else. Oh. This is a this is it for you. Yeah, like you, sir. Oh, grenade. Are you throwing grenades, Piper? What the, where'd she go? 
What the fuck? Oh, she teleported. That was weird. I, I'm finding out that I don't really like bold actions. Yeah, I need a repeater. Some sort. Yeah, let's go with this. Free for the taking. Noise. Oh, there we go. Alrighty then. Now, we just need to go to the other spot. Hopefully it shows us as well. Oh, it's wanting us to build the console. I guess we can do that, sure. Need to go outside though, huh? Let me make sure that there isn't somewhere else we could go near here. I think we still need to go to a hospital. We'll just go here. Okay, now we can build. Now we need the console. What was it? The console? No, it's this thing. Yeah, let's build this. And tatter, yes. Yes. Right, now. I can't build the console, smartass. I guess I don't think so. I don't need a generator right now, do I? No, I still need the scanner. Okay. Your time. Search hospitals. Place, kid. Your energy. It's not showing me where one is, so I'm probably going to have to search. Let me see. What is this marker? What are you? Okay, I put I, I placed that I guess. Oh, okay, here we go. Here's one. Um, but we don't. This one's a bit closer. What was this? Yeah, there's a bunch of fucking dudes over on that one. I'm pretty. Yeah, we know that for sure. Let's go over here. There was a bunch of super mutants that was slapping us around before when we had to go there to get some power armor. Try to avoid that. Right. If I just heal as well, you don't regenerate the healths. Bubble gem. I wish that they put buffs in a separate area. Just complaining, I know, but it's just kind of annoying. Very peaceful out here, at least at, at this moment. Okay, what is that? I fucking saw you. Whoever, whatever you are. I probably shouldn't go into this area. Till we find the insertion point. Trying to avoid. Avoid some uh, skirmishes. That don't need to happen.
Okay, I think it's this building here. You can check, I think. Seems that way. It's around the around the front. We could probably go in here. Side. I think this is the closest point to where we're gonna meet some enemies, more than likely. Alright, I'm ready for you fuckers. Is this about to be fucking crazy in here? I hope so. I'm ready for it. Mm, I find the quality of care at this facility to be lacking, at best. Is that right, Piper? Is that how you really feel? Dong. Approach and identify yourself. Law abiding All citizens. Clear. Piper, stop being borked, please. Coca Cola can help satiate thirst, increase energy and focus, as well as achieve dangerous glucose levels in diabetic. Please stand still and we shall begin. That thing had a fucking giant bone saw. No, thank you. Hey. Okay. I think it's saying it's upstairs in here somewhere. Nuka Cola, anyone? Anybody? Oh, okay. An elevate tower. Nice. Nice. Going up. Going up. Basement. Said the basement? What? Did we go up or down? I'm confused. Should I be out of my room? No. Certainly not. What are you gonna do about it? That's what I thought. Oh. I think I saw this dude. His glowing arms. Shooting the fucking railing, goddammit. Oh my god, it's so strong. That was strong. Law abiding citizen, please leave the area. Need to keep going up. Going up. Going I just went, isn't it? That's the bad thing about. Is to evade Where are you talking evade from? Pursuit. I was gonna say that's that's the bad thing about um. Warning, dangerous fugitive searching places in third person. Sometimes it's easy to get lost. Unfortunately. I really like being in third person, but I mean, we've had, well, the reason I like being in third person is I like seeing my character that I, you know, Continuing search for liquid nitrogen dispenser. What the fuck? Anyways, that I, 
that I have been working on. But we've, we've had the same loadout for a while, so I think we can spare being first person for now. This is just a big chonky gun. Oh god, hello. Hello, please don't, please, whatever you do, do not fucking shoot us, you monster. Oh my god. Just aim for the combat inhibitor and watch the fireworks. This is a lawful combat inhibitor. Is this? Its face? Is it the face? Eh. He's on fire. I know, Piper. I know you can carry things. Also, this game kind of gives me motion sickness in first person. I don't know why. Is this an eyewash, eyewash station? Is it going to give me radiation? Oh, you can't activate it. Mm, I'm getting lost in here. It showed what I needed, like, in the wall or some shit. I was very confused. Don't think I can pick this. Oh, okay. Hmm. Let me see where this takes me this time. Going up. So set the basement first time, I think. Ground floor now. Okay, is this where we came in? It is. Did I get what I needed? Am I an idiot? Oh. I guess I did. I didn't realize. Okay. That's nice. We'll go and save. Head back. Build what we need to build. Send me back to the sanctuary where I was born. Not really. We just didn't fuck the game up. Okay, we're good. I started clicking and dragging. I was trying to turn that. I've heard I... that folks at Finch Farm need some help. Oh fuck me! I did. I did mess the game. <laughs> Hold on. God damn it. Oh, are we good? We're good. Okay. <laughs> I was worried. <laughs> this game does not like to be uh, alt tabbed sometimes. All right, so let's make our console. Yes. Oop. What's up? Signal. Just gotta make sure we've got enough power. Okay. Um, so let me see. Hold V. Requires five. It's in resources? Power, okay. What? No, stay there. Yes, power generator. Switches, lights, miscellaneous. Because I think this produces three power, so we have We ha we'll have one here, one here, then, oh, I could just make one that does 
five instead. Okay, well, we'll start with these little generators. I don't really care. Um. Anytime you want me to carry some of that valuable gear you're lugging, you just uh. Connectors. Stay there, please. Connectors. Or can I just connect them straight to that? Let me see. Hold on. It doesn't seem right. Attach wire. Yes. Attach wire. Hey, hello. Nice. I think it's I think it's working. Yes. Okay. Then we can attach wire. Let's just get all this shit attached first. It's attaching, is it? Is it working? Hey, let's attach it to that. That needs 20 power? Holy shit. Fuck, I keep doing this. We need two of these guys, but I don't have enough. I mean, I, I can try to do, like, what? Four of these, right? Shit. Or, I guess this. No. This is a, is a test if I can use this on this too. I didn't think of that. Let's see. It still won't be enough, I don't think. Hmm, it's just enough. Nice. Nice. Oh yeah, we had two of these too. Okay, we're we're powered. As far as that's concerned. We attach wire to this. Hey yo. This needs three power. Is it working though? Attach wire to you. Yeah, it's already got power. This thing maybe just needs to be in the middle in there. We'll see. Hold on. What does it tell me to do now? Please. Just... Uh, I need to be alone right now. You're tied to this place, kid. Well, fucking... Get away from me. We're busy here. You're having issues and shit. Just gotta make sure we've got enough power. Yeah, let me... Let me just... Move this here. Hey, I, ha I knew. I, I had a feeling... All right, cool. Hopefully we don't need power anymore. I don't think so. Unless it's drained power now from this. It has, okay. Shit. What if I attach the wire to this? Nope. I don't know why I think this will work, but nope. Yeah, that's sucking all the power. Okay. Um. No. Hmm. 
Oh, nice. Okay, we can make one. <laughs> the fuck is this thing so huge? Oh, that's precariously close. I think it's about to spool up an engine. Yes, power. I okay, know. We lost the power on that. Uh, what? What happened? Is this one not on or something? So this has the power it needs. Select. I don't even know how to undo the wires. Um, what am I doing? That one already has the power it needs. Alright, it's already connected. You're tied to this place, kid. You're what happened? Dead. I'm confused. Um, activate maybe. Just gotta make sure we've got enough power. Make sure everything's on, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Running, running, running. This one doesn't seem to be running. Oh! Hey! Welcome in! That's nice to hear. Yeah, I try to I try to do that. If I can. I know the world's a, a rough place sometimes. I do my best to lift people up. Yeah, welcome in. I'm just struggling to figure out how to power stuff. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna scrap this thing. It doesn't seem to be working. Is this an 18 plus chat? Yeah. I mean, yeah, go for it. I'll just. Tell you if it's too far, I guess. Not sure what you're wanting to say. I'm confused, because this had power at, until I made this. So let me scrap this, I think. <laughs> oh my. So I think I need to break some stuff down maybe and just make another one of these little ones. I don't know. Let me see. Um, how am I? I'm pretty good aside from not really knowing uh, what I'm doing here. Hope I'm happy. Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. Just getting confused by this crafting in this game. Craft. Oh, it's like crafting stations. How do I break stuff down? I think it's at a different station, isn't it? Is it this? Hey, Kai. How you doing? Welcome in. Just trying to learn how to. I really learn how to craft, but just get the main. West crafting done. Uh, what? I need to just break some stuff down. A 
Can I like store stuff here? Wait. Store all junk. Hmm. Cause I just need to build one of these. Let me see I I guess what I need to do that. Uh no. Oh, can I just make this now? Oh, I need ceramic. For I need aluminum for this one. I feel like I can get some aluminum from some of my guns I have, but I don't know how to break them down. Do you just do that in the menu? No, it doesn't seem like it. Yeah. Maybe on this one? Weapons workbench? Oh, fucker was using it. Scrap. Okay, cool. Yes. I need to mark my minigun so I don't fucking sell it. The hell? You know what, actually? I don't... I need to run through my stuff before I start scrapping things. Make sure I... I'm not gonna scrap something I'd, I'd want to keep. Exit, please. Alright. So first off, I need to favorite my minigun, which I guess I've already done, but all right. So we have missiles. Yep. Forty-four. Yes. Shell, yep. Yeah. We have two of those, so we can scrap one. A 308, yes. Although I don't really like this one, so we can look for another 308. No, we don't have one, that's fine. Okay, um, 45. Yep. Sell, yep. Ten, check. Thirty-eight, yes. And the five for the minigun. Let me not forget to favorite this. Kill for a drink. Come to think of it, I have. Current mods, okay. I was trying to see. If it tells you what you get for breaking them down, but whatever. I really just need. Oh, it's gonna give me steel? That makes sense. What gives you aluminum? I guess I can just look here. I know I'm not the only. This is just all steel. I've lost someone. I just. I miss him so much. You're tied to this place, kid. I guess you can't Energy. scrap these starred items. I don't know what they—they're like rare or something. I don't know what their distinguishment is. Okay. Yeah, let's exit. 
Don't take offense to um, I don't think I have what I need, but I'm just gonna double check before I start doing st other other things. Nope. Still need aluminum or cer ceramic. Did I just not have? What is this? Armor. Nice being on the move again. Fewer paper cuts than back home. Do I just not have any armor on me? Maybe I gave it all to. Probably just gave it all to Piper. Piper. Hey, point the way. Take a look. Okay, she's got a bunch of shit. Yeah, give me all your shit. Just break all this down. I feel like armor is more likely to have aluminum just because it seems like all the guns are steel. So we'll see. Nope. 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 At least it tells you what you're gonna get. Is that it? Fuck. No ceramic or steel. Or uh, aluminum, sorry. I'll get out of here. Fucking stupid game. All right, so we'll check the weapons. Can you scrap junk somehow? Is that a thing? Why is none of this aluminum? Fuck you. Yeah. Well. Yes, get me out of here. So I think now we got we we, we gotta do. Cause I don't think, I guess I could maybe load and try to power this again. And maybe I messed something up. I could have been more efficient with my build or something. Yeah, cause I didn't really do anything other than putting these pieces together, so maybe I can be more efficient with how I'm using the generators. You're tied to this Shit. Place. I think this is right before I, I got generators. Smart of me to... Okay, yeah, I didn't build the console, which is fine. I think we have the parts now, yeah. Yeah! Okay. So... This needs five. Oops. Didn't realize that some of these can just straight up do five. We'll go with this. And then this one needs 20. So we'll go... I don't know if you can share them. We'll, we'll try though. So 5... 10... 15... 20... 
then that's wire to you so that's good on the power for now um let me just see if hatching this wire together to this still gives this power i guess so Okay, do you still have power? No. Right. So... I don't think you can disconnect the wire, but... Oh, lights? No, we don't want lights. We want generators. Okay, I can just straight up make another one of these that does five. Yeah, we'll just do that. I had a hunch that I just fucked up the the efficiency of my build here. Hey yo, okay, power. We have the power, nice. We'll move you to where you need to be. Go to your home. Hey yo. Oh, and then we need to attach wire to here, right? Oh, this needs two, fuck. Generator medium. What am I looking at here? What said that it needed two power? Maybe I'm good now. Maybe we're good? Let me see. Oh. Now we power it up. Um got to make sure we've got enough power. I'd like to trade some items. No, I don't want sure trade stuff. It's all on the same grid. All the parts have got to be able to talk to each other, you know. All on the same grid? Do we lose power somewhere maybe? 5 It's got power. Oh, this requires power, okay. Let's see. Uh, do I just connect this, maybe? No. Stay there. Ah! They just need to be connected to this. Are you fucking. What are you. Why are you torching my thing? Okay. Yeah, this re says it requires two power. Fuck. No. Hey there. Hate how this controls. Okay, so this can do three. Just make sure it's gonna be okay to be here. Did we do it? I think we did it. It's jank, but I think it'll work. Is it gonna pass? One of these houses would be a good place to set up some beds. Hey, Sturgis. Everything Who cares about beds? We're fucking. You ready to see Teleporting. if this actually works? Um, maybe later? I, I just don't want to- I, I don't want to get locked out of quests here. This baby. Although we won't know if it's gonna work until we actually try it. Uh, what quest am I on now? Okay, still the same one. 
Let's go for it. Start Let's here. test this thing. Everything looks good on my end. You ready to see if this thing actually works? No, I'm ready. Let's, Let's do, do it. You sure? Okay. Your part is simple. Just step onto the platform. I'll start scanning for an institute signal to lock onto. Mm. Then I fire her up and we see what happens. I'm ready when you are. Okay, so I think now. Because someone told me that once I enter the institute, that is a for sure uh, point of no return, and that's what we're about to do. I'm like 90% sure. So I'm gonna save. It's about that time. I have another on the platform. requested I'll video to watch. Rest. I have like three more <laughs> at the moment. So uh hope that's okay with y'all. Uh, I'm gonna do it up here. And then I'm gonna use the bathroom and I'll be right back and we can enjoy that. It's about almost 30 minutes, probably definitely 30 with pausing and whatnot. But uh, I'll be right back and we'll do that and then we'll get back to the game. We're gonna be doing side quests from this point until I start to feel like, uh, yeah, ready to like head towards the end of the game. But I feel like we're not even that far in the game, so ready to go. All right, I'll be right back.
All right. Yeah, we're going to react to this. Uh, it's a another 40K video about, um, I think it's just going deeper into uh, the Space Marines lore. My favorite race at the moment, or faction, I think, is the correct term. But uh, yeah, we'll get into it. Hey, welcome back, everyone. Uh, got another uh, suggested video to watch here. This is uh, 40k theory, um, uh, space marines. So I think it's just going deeper into space marine lore. Let's jump into it. Forty K theories. Hello, everyone. This is Remlays from Forty K Theories, and welcome to this new episode of Forty K Law for newcomers. For this episode, we will be taking a brief look at the Adeptus Astartes, or as they are more commonly known, the Space Marines. As always, this is a brief overview. Yeah, at first I thought Astartes was just. Uh, some kind of turn I, I don't know i thought it was made up i didn't think it had anything to do it with the the lore of the game at all uh, i i just thought it was like the title to that awesome cinematic but it's it's neat now, now that i know that it is the name of the space marines and certain events and such will have their own in-depth videos dedicated to them within the future so without further ado let's begin while the enemies of the emperor still draw breath there can be no peace. The Adeptus Astartes are genetically augmented transhuman super soldiers originally designed by the Emperor of Mankind himself. They are larger, stronger, and longer lived than regular humans, with heightened reflexes, a superior healing ability, and cognitive enhancement. They are one of the Imperium's most elite fighting forces akin to militant monastic orders so i like to i like to relate stuff to other media that i'm i'm familiar with so i would say in my mind how i'm thinking of this is these are all like every single one of these dudes are like captain america but on steroids <laughs> and they are more commonly known to the people of the imperium as the emperor's angels of death they are separated into various chapters, each with their own heraldry and unique cultural aspects. Some are brutal and savage berserkers from vicious death worlds, while others are stoic and disciplined, being the epitome of humanity's nature. Astartes are equipped with some of the finest weaponry and armor available to any of the Imperium's militant forces, and are a potent force upon the battlefield. You know what I'm just noticing? I think I've noticed this before, but these are some fucking chonky ass magazines. Like, holy shit. Is it either this is like some big ass like shotgun slug rounds or it's a shotgun pistol? I don't know. Whenever they make their presence known, they bring hope to the loyal servants of the Emperor and fear into the enemies of the shells themselves don't they look like normal. So maybe it just shoots like fucking 50 cal, like short rounds or something. Man. True justice is quite simply the will of the Emperor. The creation of the original Astartes began at the end of the Terran Unification Wars, prior to the advent of the Great Crusade. They are, in essence, the successors to the Emperor's original Thunder Warrior project, who were even larger and stronger than an Astartes, yet with much shorter lifespans. Interesting, so there was like a prototype to these dudes. That's cool. The genetic material used in the creation of the Astartes was harvested from samples taken from the infant forms of the Primarchs, the genetic sons of the Emperor himself. The Primarchs themselves would be spirited away from the Emperor's gene labs 
before they reached maturity by the Chaos Gods and scattered throughout the galaxy. These warriors augmented with Primarch DNA, the first true Astartes, would be organised into 20 separate legions, which could be up to a hundred times larger than a modern day Space Marine chapter. These legions would travel what do you mean by modern day Space Marine chapter? Like we have Space Marines? Maybe I'm being dumb, I don't know. From Terra across the galaxy to conquer and reclaim worlds in the name of the Emperor and the Imperium. Over the course of the Great Crusade, each Space Marine Legion would eventually be reunited with its respective Primarch who would take command of the Legion. Two of the Primarchs and their respective Legions would have their names and records erased from the annals of Imperial history for some unknown transgression. Who these Primarchs were and what crimes they may have committed is unlikely to ever come to light. Within the early years of M31, a civil war known as the Horus Heresy would erupt, where fully half of the remaining Space Marine Legions would rebel against the Emperor and side with the treacherous war master of the Imperium, Horus Lupercal. So I keep I keep seeing and hearing Horus. I believe Horus Horus Hesse Her Hersey or something like that is the author to the like fifty books on the subject. Um, and I think one of the main Space Marine or like even the even the like God King guy, I think his name is uh is Horus. And then the Civil War is similarly named. So just interested in like what's going on with that. This civil war would devastate the nascent Imperium and result in several This guy's drip the fuck out. All that gold and he's got a flaming fucking sword. I'm here for it. Oh yeah, he looks sick as fuck. ...several Primarchs being slain over the course of the conflict, and it would end with the Emperor being mortally wounded and interred into the life support systems of the Golden Throne. It was following the events of the Horus Heresy that the Primarch Rebute Gilliman would pen a text known as the Codex Astartes, which would restructure the Space Marine Legions into smaller chapters. Some chapters would retain their original Legion name and heraldry, while the others would take all new names and heraldry and would become known as successor chapters. Gilliman's reason for splitting the Legions was to ensure that no one man could have the power that Horus himself had, and in That's theory smart. prevent such a civil war from ever happening again. Yeah, you don't you don't want to have more than one God King, I'll tell you that. Fenris breeds heroes like a bar breeds drunks, loud, proud, and spoiling for a fight. The creation of a space marine is a long and time-consuming process, which takes approximately a decade to fully complete. This is again really weird. I've seen this a couple times. Maybe it is just like really well uh, animated here, but this like everything other than this dude's face looks hand drawn. His face is like almost, almost, if not photoreal. It looks out of place. Astartes have been known to recruit potential aspirants from a number of different sources, including from young gang members from the depths of hive worlds or from the vicious tribes of feral death worlds. Aspirants are taken at a relatively young age, typically between 10 to 12 Terran standard years of age. Oh hell yeah, we're getting into like their training and selection and shit. I'm about I love this shit. I really wish that um like Star Wars would do some sort of either series or um movies or something about like the Jedi Academy. I love the training for things. I don't know why, I'm just really into it. Each Space Marine chapter will have their own unique recruitment process, and those aspirants who are chosen will be forced to undergo certain trials to prove their worthiness to be made into an Astartes. The aspirant of the Raven Guard, for example, will be tasked with capturing and killing a Kiavaran Raven with their bare hands to prove their skill, while aspirant What is that they had to kill? A Van Raven? ...of the Blood Angels must cross a vast and dangerous desert 
to reach an area known as the Place of Challenge to prove their worth. If these aspirants... How big is this desert, though? I feel like... It must be long enough for them to have to employ some kind of, like, survival skills, right? ...prove themselves worthy, then over the course of the next six to ten years, they are implanted with each of the organs unique to Astarte's physiology. Once the implantation process has begun, these aspirants become known to the chapter as neophytes, and their training begins. As their training progresses, these neophytes will typically spend time within the scout company under the tutelage of a veteran sergeant, although this varies with some chapters. It is here in the scout company that the neophytes will be trained in the art of war and how to utilize the weaponry and equipment of the chapter. Upon the battlefield, they will be used to perform reconnaissance and utilize guerrilla tactics against the enemy. As more and more of the genetic augmentations are implanted into the neophytes, they will eventually become known as initiates to the rest of the chapter. When the initiates are deemed ready, which is roughly between 16 to 18 years of age, they will receive their final implant, the Black Carapace, and become a fully-fledged battle brother of the chapter. Once they become a battle brother... He's might explain it in a second, but the Black Carapace, I have no idea what that is. Astartes will move from the Scout Company into one of the other nine companies within the chapter, with the exception of the first company, which is purely for the most skilled and honored veteran warriors of the chapter. Once assigned to a company, these Battle Brothers will then be attached to the chapter's Devastator squads and will be tasked with calling targets to the veteran battle brothers of the squad. I love whatever gun this dude's sporting. I, like, I love glowing shit, and especially blue. Blue is my favorite color. Who will be the ones utilizing the heavy weaponry typical of a Devastator squad. After gaining some more experience, some of the younger members of the Devastators may find themselves transferred into one of the chapter's many assault squads, where they learn the art of melee and meet the enemy head-on in close combat. Once a battle brother has mastered the weaponry and tactics of the scout, devastator and assault squads, then they can become part of a tactical squad. These tactical squads form the backbone of the chapter's military strength, and thanks to their training are considered to be jacks of all trades, able to perform well in any given situation upon the field of battle. A number of aspirants, however, will be selected and trained to perform specialist tasks within the chapter. Some will be sent to Mars to undergo the training to become a Tech Marine, where they will learn the tenets of the machine cult of the Adeptus Mechanicus, and gain knowledge on how to repair the chapter's vehicles and equipment. Oh, well, I mean, ha having a like robotic arm on your back, literally just having a third arm would be fucking nice but uh i assume they also use that to repair things that's that's really neat though others will be sent to the apothecarium where they will be trained to become apothecaries medics and healers who are responsible for future gene seed implantation and recovery and others still will be selected to become chaplains who maintain the chapter's cultural beliefs and inspire their brothers to great acts of valor in the name of their Emperor and Primarch. If they are found to have psychic potential, then these aspirants may find themselves selected to join the ranks of the Librarius, becoming trained as a Librarian, warrior psychers of immense skill, discipline, and knowledge. Now, if there's ever... I, I know there's been speak of it, I think there almost was one, but if there was a... Uh, 40k MMO, I would definitely be one of these guys fucking like some some sort of like spell blade like using magic and, and a sword and or a gun as well maybe. I'd be super into that that'd be sweet. <laughs> if a hero of the chapter suffers wounds that are too grievous to be treated by the chapter's apothecaries they may find themselves entombed within the sarcophagus of a dreadnought a robotic construct 
that is, effectively, a walking tank. Within a Dreadnought, an Astartes can live on and continue to serve the chapter for millennia to come. Oh, okay, so there's like plug his brain into this automaton fucking mech thing. That's that's kind of dope. One of the most notable in this regard is Bjorn the Fell Handed of the Space Wolves chapter, who fought alongside his Primarch during the events of the Great Crusade and Horus Heresy. Unlike the rest of the Imperium who either worship the Emperor as a god or follow the tenets of the Cult Mechanicus, the majority of Space Marine chapters hold true to their ancient customs and beliefs. The tenets of each chapter cult will vary from chapter to chapter, and some can be extremely barbaric and savage. Regardless of their own cultural beliefs, all Space Marine chapters venerate the Emperor as the master of mankind, and will fight to the death to defend his Imperium and his subjects. Do not fail your brothers. Though their bodies die, their spirit must return to the chapter. That is your charge. As mentioned earlier, the basis of an Astartes genetic augmentation comes from the genetic material or gene seed derived from their respective Primarch. As a result of this, chapters that are derived from the DNA of different Primarchs will display different traits from one another, which can be as minor as behavioural quirks or as major as fully-fledged genetic markers. Following the events of the Horus Heresy, only the gene seed of the nine loyalist Primarchs is officially used in the process of creating successor chapters, but there have been rumours and speculation that some chapters have utilised a gene seed of some of the traitor Primarchs. When an aspirant begins the process of being transformed into an Astartes, a total of 19 separate organs are implanted into them if they are to become a standard Astartes, with an additional three implants in the case of Primaris Marines, which shall be covered later on. While some of these organs are fully functional immediately after implantation, some will only become viable after certain other organs are implanted, or through a series of chemical treatments and hypnotherapy. The first of these organs to be implanted is the secondary heart, which not only functions as a backup for the Astartes' own natural heart, but this organ can also help an Astartes survive in low oxygen environments and maintain blood flow. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, because I guess if... Yeah, if you have two hearts, you can either use um use your oxygen more effectively or pump oxygen better through your body something like that the second is the osmodular which helps reinforce an astartes skeleton with ceramic materials that is drawn from the astartes own diet in addition this organ causes the bones to grow longer and thicker accounting for the astartes increased size that makes a lot of sense imagine that wouldn't that be cool if, like, you could eat something, and it would just make your bones stronger? And then, you, then, then people could actually be th just thick-boned. <laughs> as well as altering the rib cage into a series of interlocking plates to better protect the organs within. The third is the Biscopia, which stimulates the growth of extra muscle mass, enhancing Anastati's physical strength. Fourth is the Hemastamin, which increases the amount of hemoglobin within the Astartes' bloodstream, making it more efficient at transporting oxygen throughout the body. You know what? So I, I made a I made a thumbnail with this image, and I was trying to re I was trying to read these and I was just like, is this just in some sort of 40k language? But I think they're either that it is 40k language, these actually relate to like actual organs, or they just like made up the names for them. But it's all, it's all coming together now. <laughs> the fifth is the Laramans organ, which is implanted into the chest and connected to the circulatory system. It secretes special Laramin cells, which attach to the leukocytes within the blood if the Astartes is injured. 
These cells will then quickly seal off almost any wound that the Astartes has suffered, giving an Astartes their remarkable resilience. Sixth is the Catalepsia node, which is implanted within an Astartes brain. This organ controls the body's circadian rhythm, and allows the Astartes to switch off certain portions of their brain in response to sleep deprivation, allowing an Astartes to remain awake for up to two weeks straight at a time. That's insane, because I, I, don't, I don't know if you guys have looked into it, but like sleep, def sleep deprivation does some crazy shit to you. I think it happens pretty fast too. Like within a couple of days of no sleep, like you are an absolute. You're, at, you're just out of, you're out of your mind. You're hallucinating things. It's not good. The seventh organ is the preomnor. This organ acts as a secondary stomach, which neutralizes poisonous materials before they enter the stomach, rendering an Astartes immune to ingesting most types of toxins. Eighth is the omophagia which is implanted within the spinal cord and connected to the stomach. This allows an Astartes to experience the memories of the dead by eating their flesh. What the fuck? That, I mean, that's useful. That's weird. <laughs> what the hell? Ninth is the multi-lung, which allows an Astartes to breathe toxic gases, atmospheres with low oxygen density, and even water by shutting off their natural lungs in favor of this third lung. Okay, I knew that they had three lungs just from comments, but I didn't realize that it was like a multifunctional lung that could breathe water and like, you know, in other atmospheres and shit. That's cool. The tenth organ is the oculobe, which when used in conjunction with the correct stimuli and therapy, increases the growth of the retinal cells within the eye, giving Astartes the ability to see perfectly in low light environments, as well as enhancing their eyesight to a level far superior than that of unaugmented humans. The eleventh is the Lyman's ear. This organ completely replaces an Astartes natural ear, for one that not only enhances an Astartes hearing, allowing them to filter and enhance specific sounds, but also renders an Astartes immune to motion sickness. I fucking wish, guys. I have the worst motion sickness, and I just wanted to point out, so, like, special forces and just a anyone that's on the battlefield, uh, they nowadays get, um, forget, I forget the actual company, but it's these, these headsets that they have microphones on them, and they're normal, like, shooting range, shooting range headsets but with the microphones you can hear what's going on around you and then they're programmed to um like just cut out like live basically edit out uh, gunshots I, I actually i think what happens is it just turns the mic off and then you just have the protective um sound dampening from the headset but they basically just have it built into their ears, and that's fucking cool shit. <laughs> and unable to be made dizzy. Twelfth is the Susan membrane, which allows an Astartes to enter a state of suspended animation, either consciously or as an instinctive response to severe trauma, allowing them to survive for centuries even after suffering the most grievous of wounds. They can survive for centuries? How... how I guess they might get to it, but uh, how long is their like normal lifespan? That seems insane. The thirteenth organ is the melanchromic organ. This controls the amount of melanin within the skin of an Astartes, affording them protection from not only intense sunlight by darkening the skin when needed, but also many types of radiation, even that which would kill regular humans outright. Again, super useful. <laughs> 14th is the ulictic kidney, which in conjunction with the secondary heart, filters the bloodstream of an Astartes at rapid pace to purge their system of toxins, giving them protection from most types of poisons and venoms. If an Astartes is afflicted with a lethal dose of toxins, the ulictic kidney can perform an emergency detoxification 
of an Astartes bloodstream, but this will render them temporarily unconscious due to the rapid pace at which blood is pumped through the body. Fifteenth is the Neuroglottis, which heightens an Astartes sense of taste to an extreme degree, allowing them to identify numerous chemical components by taste alone. Oh, I was like, how is that going to be helpful? But goddamn, they're just like the strongest motherfucking detectives around. <laughs> and even track down an enemy by taste in a similar manner to a Jacobson's organ found within snakes. The 16th organ is the mucronoid, which coats the skin of an Astartes with a waxy secretion to protect them from extreme temperature and even provides limited protection from exposure to the vacuum of space. Oh fuck, they got like basically just auto <laughs> auto applying sunblock for space. Seventeenth are the Betcher's glands, which allows an Astartes to spit a potent and highly acidic venom. The penultimate organs to be implanted What? <laughs> They're venomous too? Jesus. Are the progenoid glands. These glands are arguably the most important of all the gene seed implants, for they will absorb genetic material from the other implants over the course of a decade until they become gene seed. These organs will then serve as a repository storing the data of all the other organs within Anastates, so if an Astartes is slain in battle, the gene seed can be recovered and returned to the chapter where new organs can be grown and implanted into new aspirants, keeping the chapter alive. The final organ is the black carapace, which is implanted under the skin of an Astartes. This carapace allows an Astartes to perfectly interface with its power armor at a neurological level. That's really cool. Allowing it to become, effectively, a part of their bodies. Yeah, imagine, imagine like being able to automatically clear a jam in your in your rifle. Like, I feel like that's the kind of shit you could probably do with this thing, like without having to, you know, actually interface with it. You just like think about it and it's just it does it. However, over the course of the last 10,000 years, the gene seed stock of the various Space Marine chapters has begun to slowly degenerate. Flaws within the gene seed are becoming more and more commonplace. Some of these flaws are relatively minor, such as the Death Spectres chapter suffering a defective melanchromic organ, resulting in the warriors of the chapter suffering from albinism. Wait, so with them having all these implants, could they not just get another set of ears? I mean, how? What? Doesn't make sense. Why would they just be always like forever deaf? Or is it like a choice? I think others are much more drastic, such as the Black Dragons chapter suffering from a hyperactive osmodular organ, resulting in the warriors of the chapter developing bony horns and crests, as well as blade like protrusions from their arms. Okay, that's just fucking badass. <laughs> be a man rhino and or Baraka. <laughs> To monitor the stability and purity of the gene seed, each chapter is ordered to send roughly 5% of their gene seed stock at regular intervals as a tithe to the Adeptus Mechanicus. Once the tithes have been received, the Adeptus Mechanicus will conduct purity checks upon it to determine if the mutations within the gene seed break the bounds of tolerance of genetic purity. If a chapter's gene seed is deemed too flawed or too impure, then that chapter will be destroyed along with any and all of their gene seed stock. On the incantation of activation, speak forth the litany of retribution and deliver unto our enemy the wrath of the Omnissiah. In addition to a standard Astartes, there are also what are known as Primaris Space Marines. These particular Astartes have their origins set during the events of the Horus Heresy, with the Raptor Project conducted by the Primarch Corvus Corax of the Raven Guard Legion, which failed thanks to the actions of Alpha Legion double agents. But following the events of the Horus Heresy, 
the Primarch Rebute Gilliman instructed the Archmagus Dominus of the newly restructured Adeptus Mechanicus, Belisarius Call, to begin the creation of a new breed of Astartes that would aid the Imperium in its darkest hour. Primaris Marines are physically larger and stronger than a typical Astartes, and in addition, boast a gene seed that is far more stable. If they couldn't get any more strong. <laughs> Bigger and stronger, yes. With only a 0.001% chance of genetic deviation. This stability... Oh, I see Ultra on his pauldron here. Is it... Are these the Ultra... Ultra Marines I've heard? Heard whispers about? ...has also been able to seemingly eliminate some of the most incurable and infamous of genetic flaws, such as the Black Rage within the Gene Seed of the Blood Angels, as well as having enhanced strength, size, and Gene Seed stability. Primaris Marines also feature three additional genetic implants over standard Astartes. These are the Sinew Coils, which reinforce the sinews within the Astartes body with durametallic cabling that also enhances the host's strength and acts as another form of internal protection, the Magnificat, which enhances the growth rate of a Primaris Marine's body as well as the efficiency of their internal organs, and finally, the Belisarian Furnace. Again, glowing blue, I'm all about this, I want this. If, if this was real, I would have it. <laughs> it might be. Which expels a series of Somewhere. stimulants in the events of extreme stress or physical trauma, which also aids with the regeneration of any wounds that the Astartes has received. Many Space Marine chapters have been reinforced with this new and improved breed of Astartes, and even entire chapters have been founded that are comprised entirely of Primaris Marines given the Imperium some much-needed reinforcement. However, it should also be noted that while some chapters welcome these new Astartes with open arms, some chapters have outright refused Primaris reinforcement for various reasons. And that concludes this edition. I'm gonna go out, go out on a limb and say one of those reasons is like pride. I feel like I get a lot of pride vibes from these guys. <laughs> like they don't want someone bigger and stronger coming in to like back them up. It makes sense. Edition of 40k law for newcomers. If you like this video, consider supporting us on Patreon. All right, I don't think there's anything else at the end of this. Let me just make sure. The credits. Video. All right, yeah. Thank you again for another amazing suggestion. Uh, and if yeah. As always, if you guys uh, have anything else you think I would enjoy reacting to, uh, go ahead and just leave it in the comments, and uh, I'll do my best to get to it. But I'll see y'all in the next one. Thank you. I don't know why I muted myself. Anyways, all right, cool. Let's get back to our Vigi game. Thank y'all for uh, hopefully enjoying that. That one was a bit long, but it was very cool. Again, definitely my favorite uh, faction that I've learned about so far in uh, 40k. But uh, let's see what else we can do here, because we have... I think we've definitely reached our um, point of no return. But it seems very, very uh, soon in the game. Uh, anyways, we will... Well, this is, this is going to have just a marker at Sanctuary, isn't it? Yeah, probably. Let me just figure out what this is. Out of fire. I guess we could see the summary about it. Okay, some people at a farm request, re have requested help from the Minutemen, so we should we'll check that out. So yeah, we're going to be doing side quests um, until at least definitely for the end of this stream uh, and then maybe tomorrow and I'll just play it by ear, you know, see how I'm feeling. Um, I think the rest of the game, the uh, um, the main game anyways, I don't know if I'm going to be doing the, the DLCs again. I'll play it by ear.
but uh the rest of the main story i've been told is like 10 hours so that's probably like a whole week of streams for me so i just gotta keep that in mind i don't want to get burnt out but uh yeah let's see where this has taken us haven't discovered it okay we have gone here though i don't think i'm over encumbered am i i don't think so I think I loaded, or I didn't save when I uh, was trying to scrap things. I got encumbered trying to scrap things. I took everything away from Piper. Make sure I have my weapon. Oh yeah, I forgot I can just draw it with R. I'm going the right way. Oh, I thought jumping used your AP. I guess it doesn't. Maybe it doesn't fall out 76. That's why I thought. That's why I thought that that could be a thing. I only played that for a little bit. It is fun. I feel like it's only good if you just need that Fallout itch, you know, aside from the main games, which you should definitely def definitely play the main games first. Hello? Hey, you! Oh, sorry. Thought you might be one of those forged maniacs, but you don't have the burns. A group of them took over the old ironworks, and they'll shoot you just as soon as look at you. Just, just some measly raiders, really? It takes a lot more than a bunch of punks to scare me. Maybe that's because you ain't got a farm and a family to think about. Even so, those guys are serious. That bastard son of mine, Jake, snuck out in the middle of the night to join him. He grabbed my granddad's old sword. It's the closest thing I've got to an heirloom. If you really are with the Minutemen and you want to help, well, it would mean a lot to me if you could get that sword back. I'm going to keep the fuck out of this sword. <laughs> I want a sword so bad. It sounds cool. You want me to take a knife from a gunfight? Oh, this is a whole new level of stupid. Even for me. You're doing me a big favor. And I'll make it up to you as best as I can. Oh, I think... I was, like, trying to figure out that... Knife in a gunfight reference, but... I think he should... My character was just calling him a pussy that he's scared to go fight someone with a gun. Who Like, take a gun to fight someone who has a knife. When usually it's the other way around that's hard. <laughs> or like, that people are worried about. Okay, we haven't discovered this yet. I think, so I think our mission is just to get... Yeah, just to get the sword. That sounds dope. Hell yeah. Hell yes. Also, do I run faster? Am I gun away? I think you do, slightly. Alright, if this place is anything like the first... Fucking, where was that at? Where, where was that place? Kicked my ass in the beginning of the game. I wasn't supposed to be there. It was my fault. Yeah, if it, this, this is anything like the assembly plant. I just need to get right inside here. As soon as possible. Oh, fuck you. They have it trapped. Clever bastards. I also can't jump on rocks or my game will fucking die. <laughs> I don't know I don't know why, but I've had that bug. It like I'll fall and then everything turns white and then black. No jumping on rocks. It's very unsafe. For the engine and for your health. I'm growing in the front door, I guess.
Yeah. Oh, this guy's strong as fuck. Hey, Disney, what's up? Welcome in. Oh, God. Ah! You got a fucking flamethrower? Piper is such a fucking bad bitch. <laughs> she don't give a fuck. Earlier, earlier, she just like, someone dropped a Gatling gun and she's like, yeah, this is mine. I can carry oh, grenade. Cards up, bitch. Fuck off. Ah. Is there anywhere to put yourself out? Does jumping work? Oh god, the... That car is about to explode. Oh, there's your head, bud. What's the giveaway? 50 doll hairs. 50 smackaroos. Once I reach... Uh, you can do uh, exclamation point giveaway. And I'll explain it. But basically, once I reach 40 subs, uh, I'm going to give away a $50 gift card to... I'll announce it on my Twitter and Discord. So um, if you're interested, make sure you follow those. But um... My mic is cutting out. Is it really? Thank you for telling me. Uh, I'm not hearing the cutting out, but um, maybe reload. Maybe try that. Uh, I I'm monitor monitoring it now. Um, I might just be stuttering. I kind of do that sometimes. Hold on. <laughs> Let me pause so I can fully explain this without stuttering um yes so if you sub uh you have a chance to win $50 I'll be giving away the $50 um once I reach 40 subscribers um and I'll I'll be doing it during I'll be giving away this $50 uh via a gift card um through Amazon you just you just have you if you win you just have to uh send me your your email, uh, and I then I can shoot you the the uh, the code for this Amazon gift card, and you but you have to be present during the actual giveaway time, which will more than likely be in the middle of my stream, and I'll announce when that stream is going to be. Um, it's going to be after I reach forty subs, but I'll announce it on my Twitter and Discord. So everyone knows, and it'll be like around the middle of that stream. Hopefully, I hopefully I did a decent job explaining that. Just don't want to like make anyone feel like they they're being swindled or anything like that. You know, want to make that clear. Because yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to hit forty subs and then like. I don't know. Maybe this is a dumb idea, but I don't know. <laughs> I just wanted to like give give money back to uh, the community if I could, because to to me, like what I received from forty subs is a hundred dollars. So this is a fifty fifty split between the community and me, which I think is pretty dang good. And if if you're t on time, which you sir, you're still here, Disney. And or ma'am or they, sorry. Um, if you're if you come back around this time, when I am am doing the giveaway, you could be the only person here because I honestly don't have that many chatters or like active people, especially not subscribers. Do uh, so you have like a really high chance of just winning and like profiting what like at least forty five dollars? <laughs> so it's up to you. No pressure. But uh, if no one subs, not again, no pressure. If but if no one subs, um, by next week, so probably <laughs> I know. Can you tell I'm new? I'm newer. I've never done a giveaway. Okay, I'm nervous about it. Um, but yeah, if no one subs by probably 
at the end of next stream, I'm going to be doing no promises, but I feel like the most fun idea I can think of is like doing a bean boozled thing. I don't know if you guys know what that is, but basically like you get a package of um, jelly beans and you, you spin a wheel and it lands on a color of a jelly bean there in the in the box you have um basically you have like a 50 50 chance of getting a nasty jelly bean and i'll be eating a jelly bean every to every time someone subs so should be pretty fun i don't know let me know if you'd be interested in that or not i think it'd be pretty funny what was i doing i need to heal Yeah, I hope you're having a good day there, Disney. Dirty water. We don't want the dirty water. I just, I don't know. I kind of don't really care. I wish I could just eat everything and just not care about radiation. Maybe I can. I do have Rataway, but it's kind of expensive. Fuck, that had radiation, didn't it? I just have so much shit, and it's like... I think most of my weight that I'm carrying around... ...is in my aid. <laughs> what the fuck? Mysterious Serum has... ...lethal amounts of radiation. 36,000, that's crazy. Okay. Run, running! Fuck you with your flamethrower. Bullshit. Stop it! Stop! Stop! Can I shoot the flamethrower? I could see. What the fuck's happening? There we go. He was not going down without a fight there. Yeah, let me know if your my voice isn't coming through clearly. Um, as far as I can tell. It's pretty good. I'll keep checking it. You got me paranoid about it now. I really want to get the perk that, um, oh, that's right, I can level up, actually. I want to get the perk that lets you, um, actually, can I get shit now? I think it's, what is it? Ghoulish. Radiation re regenerates your lost health. So then I can legit eat anything. But, um... Hey, yeah, yeah, I'm, so, again, don't, don't wanna, don't wanna, uh, uh, deceive anyone? I'm not, like, I'm, I'm straight, uh, I don't think anyone has, um, a choice in that, you know? But I definitely do support, um, LGBTQA+, any, anything that anyone wants to do that doesn't hurt anyone else, I feel like that is completely to do and I really hate seeing people you know be put down for it um, I'm pretty sure the correct term is ally that's what that's what I am if I haven't already said that but um yeah like to like to embrace that in my community so yeah you're very welcome there Disney good um, good vibes here especially um I don't know if Kai is still here my mod uh, they are uh, in the same boat in some sort of way. I'm not sure exact details, but yeah. I like to foster 
a welcoming community to everyone. Okay, are we crippled or encumbered? We're encumbered, fuck. I've been cucumbered. And I'm being attacked. From where? Fuck. Oh shit, you're throwing shit at me now? What? Ah! What the fuck? <laughs> so I need to get inside. I need to run inside because they're gonna rain hell from the rooftops at me. I should have known this. Shit. Shit. Why did it pause like in the middle? No, I will not come back. Well, I'll get you eventually, but from inside, where it's safe-ish. Ish. Key, key point there. Get some you know, fucking... Another flamethrower? Bullshit. Damn it, I don't have AP. Fuck. I don't think I'm the right level for this place, but we're, we're, we're gonna try. I am on the easiest difficulty, but this game kicks my ass, man. <laughs> oh, sh I need to fucking trade with Piper. Come to me. Yeah, can we trade mid combat? We can. <laughs> What's that? What's right, Disney? Turn my AC on. The flags had you fooled. I'm sorry about that. I just... It was Pride Month, right? And again, it like... I've seen a few of my... Um, a few of my friends... Who were all, like all about Pride. I, I supported them through that. Um, and then I saw... From a couple places, that, like a couple people, like they're like, okay, Pride Month's over. Go back to hiding. Like, fuck that. So like, I'm like, hell no, fuck that. Like, <laughs> like this needs to be a thing all the time. So that's the that's the only reason I have the flags on there. I guess I'll take them off. Um, I'm sorry if I deceived you. Um, yeah. No, my bad. I don't. I, I don't know. I I'm just trying to support. You know. Just trying to trying to support my friends, you know, the people that I know know are being depressed, not depressed, but oppressed. I'll make a note. Actually, no more flags, I guess. I wish that there was a way to do that without, um, I don't know, without deceiving people. But I guess that's the case, unfortunately. Okay. Um, what was I doing? Is she full of, is her inventory? It's probably full, right? I have any doubles just to check. I wish it gave you a number of her, um, carry potential I guess yeah she's full okay so we're just dropping things at this point yeah I, I mean I, I do have um or I had safe space in in my tags I think but maybe I could just like add a safe space in there ally safe space something like that yeah I don't know I'll think I'll think it I'll think it through. But uh need to just go through my weapons right now. Figure out <laughs> my cat is being really cute right now. <laughs> I have no idea what she's doing. I have, I have like some papers on the ground. She's just throwing them around. I think maybe there's some bugs in there or something. I don't know. She loves it though. She's having the best time. Just making noise though. 
Okay. No, I don't want to use this. I just want to be able to use my fucking arrow keys to go down on this, because... Go down, no. Not what I meant. <laughs> I chose death! <laughs> <laughs> Choose death. Um... Sorry, I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm getting pretty tired. <laughs> Sometimes my brain doesn't work cr quite well. Cr I can't even talk right now, Jesus. Uh, my brain doesn't work quite well. Choose death over bugs. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I don't like bugs either. I, I actually like sprayed my whole apartment. Um, even though I'm pretty sure that they do that. But I was getting a lot of bugs. And uh, I, I, I actually have, like, the spray ready to go. So I can just, like, directly spray a bug if I see one. But, um... Yeah. Forgive me. When I get really tired, I, like, keep doing stuff over and over again. And this... Trying to... Go through my fucking inventory is gonna be... Bad. <laughs> so I also have, like, ADD. <laughs> So I get really distracted. <laughs> Just give me a second, if you don't mind. Bonk. Bonk. Uh, or don't. Bonking the bugs. Yes, we bonk. We bonk bugs in this house. We stand. Okay. Anyways. So we have missiles. Okay. Cool. Check. I'm not even sorting this correctly, damn it. I also unequipped my weapon, which I need to equip before I forget. No ammo. Hate that gun. Hate that gun. Yeah, give me this. Okay. So yeah, we got missiles check covered. We got 44 covered. Wait. Okay, I need to start something. Do something else here. So we got missiles. 44. I like to keep one of every ammo type just in case. I'm like paranoid that I'm going to run out of ammo. <laughs> uh, yeah, shells. We, we got. I don't like that gun, but we have it just in case. 308. Got. Right, we haven't done that one. I thought I thought I saw a cell gun already, but I didn't. This is why I'm like using a sticky note right now to mark off like what I have. Uh, okay. Ten, yeah. Good on that. Thirty-eight. Yep. Okay, we don't need that. Gonna drop that. Drop that, drop that. Fuel? What the fuck? Flamer. That's interesting. Wait. It doesn't do that much damage, that's weird. Dad joke time? Glad you glad you brought that up. However, my brain is not working right, so I'm gonna look one up. <laughs> you don't mind. Feel free to share your dad jokes as well. I've been really worried about my calendar, you know? Its days are numbered. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> That's kind of a good one, I don't know. Its days are numbered. That is a fact. Better watch itself. OK. 
Okay, well, we have a new ammo type. Fuel. Fuel. Did we like that one? Would you like another? Usually I have like at least five probably somewhere around there, but I feel like I say them over and over again, but I cannot my brain right now. I, not happening. I got like one, like one more hour to, to reach my, uh, what I like to, the length of stream I try to hit, but I'm struggling right now. My hair's not cooperating right now. Hold on. Ah, uh, guess that works. My hair is in a transitional state right now. I'm like trying to find a good um, product to use, but I think it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be all right. Okay, so uh, we're not going to use this flamer thing, but we will favorite it because it's a, its own ammo type. Cool. 38, so we don't need that. Right? So we already have it. Shoe on the head on my on my hair. I'll do it. You know what? Fuck it. I'll do it. We'll do it live. All right, just for you. Yes. You know what? Fuck the hair. Fuck it. It's gonna get messed up anyways. All right. Let me get comfy here. I guess we'll do this for the whole rest of this uh, compound. All right, and then if 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 I fail in the terms of the challenge, if I fail, uh, you get another fifty channel point redemption for free. All right, all right, here we go. Get comfy. Okay, it's gonna be annoying trying to write on my sticky note, but you know what? I did- I've done this to myself, you see. I made this. <laughs> I made this challenge. Okay. So we don't need 38. Yeah. So we can drop this, right? Yeah. Minigun. <laughs> uh... Yeah, we're good. Alright. Okay, we're still encumbered. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, let me just. This is much easier. Just look for pluses to defense. Really. Ooh, this looks really good. Oh yeah, armored coat. Fuck yeah, that's a giant upgrade. I fucking dropped it. Damn it. I'm an idiot. Uh, give me, give me, give me, give me. No, please equip this. Thank you. Okay. We good. Just need to drop things now. I'm gonna forget this is on my head. Usually I use my sneaker, but uh, this was closer. <laughs> it's way lighter, and I can't really feel it. Yeah, we'll just drop all the... 
armor so we have a little breathing room and don't have to do this so often. Okay, and we'll do a little quick save. How are we looking? What do we look like? Nice. Look cozy. Ooh, fuck. Goddamn grenades, man. Holy shit. You can't see why, because I'm shooting you in your fucking eyeballs, maybe. Little bitch. Where are you running? Holy oh, <laughs> shit. And I'm already... <laughs> Diz! <laughs> What's going on? How you doing? We're doing a little shoe on the head challenge here for the rest of this... Uh, this... Um, quest. We're trying to find a sword in this place. Cage armor. And I'm very cumbered. I've been quite cumbered. Or I'm crippled? I, I guess I was cumbered. Fuck. Just clear this place out. I think it's showing me where this sword is supposed to be. Disappearing act, huh? but we're gonna find this shit because I want a sword so bad. That sounds dope. I'm on fire. This is true. I was. There's so many like flamethrower dudes in here. I guess they're all downstairs. Oh, except for you, fucking turret. Asshole. Get heal up. Yep, yeah. I'm put the ground part of the shoe on my head. I don't even fucking care. I don't even care. I chose death. <laughs> I chose death is correct. <laughs> okay. Give me all the things that don't have rads, please. I wish that that was a way. To, I wish you could sort that. I don't think you can. Value, weight. Maybe value helps a little bit. Kind of, because yeah, I could use this stuff down here first. For using the more expensive things. That kind of makes sense to me. Should have been doing this the whole time. It's okay. Noodle cup. Hell yeah. Alright, that's pretty good. I'll save. Help. Oh. To leave. Oh. What? <laughs> the fuck is happening? I take it this guy has the fucking. Oh my god. Oh, it's gonna do nothing, isn't it? All right. You know what? Fuck it. It's time. We have a missile launcher. I knew a time would come when this would come in handy. Seems like now. Mm. We'll try for his head. We don't have the fucking... <laughs> can manually do it though. Oh my god, oh my god. We need to get like under him or something? Fuck. On fire. Again. This is not good. Very not good. Where is my aid, please? Thank you. Value? I have already forgotten that the... I forgot twice now that the chew is on my head. This is bad. Oh, okay. Rat axe, cherry. Right. Strip stim packs now, eh? Yeah, it's worth it. Pin him down. Ooh. Fuck, where'd he go? Stop it! I need to kill your boss. Shit, I need to reload actually. 
Fuck. I'm glad I saved before I came in here. Can I reload, please? How do you do that? Oh god. Ah. Okay. Okay. We're gonna have to do this twice, I think, but... That's fine. I'm gonna switch to the good old shotgun here. They're like right in front of me and just take these guys out. Oh my god. Stop, please! Really should have saved that crit for the boss. Shit, now I'm... Now I've cumbered myself. I'm an idiot. Uh... Nice. Is it just him now? That dude with the flamethrower felt like more than one guy. Just being an asshole. Alright. Fuck! <laughs> I missed! No. Oh, I still have one more shot, Do it, don't I? Alright, we're not using... We're not using vats this time. Get you right in the fucking head. Asshole. I, I am out, right? Yeah. But I would throw cocktails. I'm not even sure how to throw grenades, to be totally honest. Um. Yes. Hey, yeah, yeah, fucking die. Oh yeah, it only has two shots, fuck. Oh no, that's lava. Oh shit, what the fuck? <laughs> it's not good. All my stim packs. Fuck. Alright, I need to change weapons. I this is why I don't like the shotgun, it only has two shots. You hold alt to throw? Trust you. Why don't you people just leave us alone? It it works. Shit. Oh, wrong one. Fucking die. No one panic. Such a weird keybind. I don't know what just happened, but that didn't work. Alright, that's not working very well. This is why I don't use... <laughs> this is why I don't use them. Right, um... Just stim packs now. Am I out of stim packs? If I'm out of stim packs, then I think we're just eating rad things now. Fucking radical! Let's get sick! Totally fine. Mm, are you right? You could be. You were correct, but it's just very janky. <laughs> Especially in third person, where, how I like to play, so. It's fine. It's not your fault. Um, yes. Just give me this shit. We're gonna blast him. He'll be dead. There we go. Fuck you. Fuck you. That sword looked fucking cool as shit. What the hell? Give me that right now. I'm not giving this to him. I'm not returning this. I don't care what it says. I'm gonna kill the guy that I'm supposed to return it to because that's the most evil thing I could think of. Um. Yeah, where's this at? Yo. Oh, it's the shish kebab. That's fucking cool. Let's go. Hell yes. Oh. oh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Alright, we're good. We're good? Are we good? Alright. I need to drop things. <laughs> I call this a, su a success, guys. If I make it... I don't know. Do I have to keep it on my head? Do I have to keep the shoe on my head until I get out of the place? 
Because I feel like I won. I feel like I've won it. Is this acceptable? Oh, this is power armor. Sick. I need to store this shit somewhere. It's so heavy. Spiked armor. Drop that. You just drop these. I'm not going to use them. All right. Inventory time. Once again. Um, okay. This is the hardest thing because I got to like look down. Okay, so missiles check. Hello? There we go. 44 check. I don't need two of these. So you can just drop that right away. Shell check. Shish kebab. Fucking check. <laughs> That's so cool. I'm glad. I'm really glad I got this. Um, just drop that extra one. Three oh eight check. Hmm. Okay, 45. Did I already do that? I had did not. Okay. Sell. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuel? Oh shit, I got a full ass flamethrower now? I know that I had another fuel thing. Um, well, favorite this though. Probably don't need all these weapons, but it's fun. I like I like the security of having backup, you know? Okay, fuel. Yes. Way good. 10 millimeter check. Cell we already had. Yeah. Drop that. 38. No. But we're good. Another 38. We can drop this. Fuel can drop. Drop. Uh, wow. Why is this showing me? That was weird. It was showing me the fucking flamethrower for the sniper rifle, and I was very confused. Or, pipe rifle, sorry. Good. Minigun. Good. Okay, I think we're good to go to get the fuck out of here. I really need to sell, but it's so fucking boring to watch, so... Made a mistake. Now you pay for it. Who's still here, Piper? Who is it? I basically have a lightsaber now. This is fucking sick. It's so cool. Oh, it leaves trails of fucking... F oh my god. It leaves trails of fire? I'm so happy, guys. This is cool. What? You say something? Fuck. That's a mine. Disarm. And take. Yes, please. I really shouldn't just loot everything from everyone, so that gets really annoying. How do I get out of here? You're mine Fuck. Now, rookie. What was that? Fuck. I'm just running. Running. I guess I gotta completely get out of here now. I see you. What am I saying? I don't. I don't even know at this point. 
So I guess the challenge is definitely not over because there's still dudes that I gotta get through to get out of here. Where's the terminal? Yeah. This is fucking epic as shit. I'm not- I'm- I did it again, fuck. I'm definitely not giving this away. Everything on everyone? Yeah. True. My thoughts exactly. Why did I not drop those? Because I definitely don't use them. Oh, because they don't weigh anything, huh? Probably not going to use the mine either. Hmm. I don't want it to blow up on me. Sure. Alright. How the fuck do I get out of here? Exit. Nice. We, get, we we got a key. That that's that's the good part about looting everything from everyone. Is you get keys and shit. All right. Um. Call me a coward, I guess, but I, I'm running out of here. Fuck off. Fuck off, I said. Oh my god, I like... I thought I... S the way it looked, I... God damn it. I, this is the worst habit to have. Fuck it, I don't need this power armor. I don't even care. I'm getting out of here. We're winning. Oh, did I? I took some buff or something that made me able to carry more shit. I'm out of here, suckers. Frig off. I did it, guys. I've won the challenge. Are you happy? Are you happy about this? H having done this to me? I hope you are. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm just happy that someone used my channel points. N not saying anyone has to, but just happy it happened, alright? Okay. Give me all the radiation. I don't even care. Where am I turning this in at? Because I'm going to kill the guy. Or at least tell him to fuck off, I'm keeping this sword. For sure. <laughs> Words cannot express my unlimited joy. I couldn't say it better myself. I'm glad you're... Words. <laughs> I'm glad you're unspeakably happy. What? Where did you come from? You missed the whole thing! You fucking idiot. Now I just gotta slap you around. I'm not looting you. You can't tempt me. Take me back. Oh man. Yeah, I think I'm gonna end... Um, once I turn this in, just not shock anyone. I'm pretty tired. My brain isn't working. Ooh, there's a well. All right, definitely going to be filling up on this in a minute. Off stream. Put this sword away. Abraham. Any luck finding my granddad's sword? Nope. Mm -mm, I didn't find it. There, there was no sword. There wasn't. It wasn't there. 
Nope. Watch your back with the forged. <laughs> They're a treacherous bunch of cusses. Okay. Uh, is there any other way to get like a reward from him? Mr. Finch. Any luck finding my granddad's sword? Guess not. Nope. Watch your back. Nope. All right then. Well, that was that was an eventful stream. Glad y'all uh, stuck around. Um, I'm gonna find find someone to raid here, and I will be back um, Wednesday. Y'all in for some more shenanigans. Uh, same time, same place. 11 p.m. EST Wednesday. See you's on here. Ooh, there's a decent selection. There's not usually this many people on. Um, hey yo, so someone else is playing Fallout 4. I don't I think I've only raided this person a couple times. They're pretty cool though. Uh, name's Ari. I'm pretty sure. Is how you say it? They're not on my list here. Hold on. There they are. Start up the raid here. Yes, good night. Good night, Ziz. See you around, buddy. Uh, yeah. Be back Wednesday.